Utah's anti-death penalty protesters were making a stand in the state capital, but it looks like Ronnie Lee Gardner's fate is sealed. And he's chosen the manner of his own execution. I would like the firing squad, please, Gardner told the court. The 49-year-old was sentenced to death in 1985 for killing an attorney during a failed escape attempt from custody. Gardner was about to go on trial for another murder in Salt Lake City's Court of Justice, but in the basement, a female acquaintance slipped him a loaded gun, and then he tried, but failed, to shoot his way out of the building. That's the person we're dealing with here. That's the kind of person where you say life without a parole is not appropriate, and I support the jury in making that very, very tough personal decision. Lawmakers in Utah actually stopped convicts electing to die by firing squad in 2004, but because Gardner's conviction was earlier, he's kept the right to choose. The victim's former girlfriend says he would not have wanted his killer to be executed. It's not what we wanted. <laughs> so you're disappointed? Very. And Michael? He would be very disappointed. Gardner's lawyers will appeal to Utah's Supreme Court, hoping the sentence will be commuted to life without parole. But if that fails, an execution date has been set for June 18th. Bernard Smith, Al Jazeera.